Hi there, this is Dave with Backrow Mapbooks, and today I'm going to give a demo of how to use the layer menu. So to start off, I'm going to click on the Layers button in the bottom left corner. And you can see we have our Layers menu organized into certain sections. At the top we have our Base Map, where you can choose between BRMB Canada and the Satellite option. So you can see it switches to Satellite Imagery. We also have uh, saved on this device, so you can have your saved waypoints and tracks. So you can see now I have some of my waypoints showing up. And then below we have BRMB Adventures, so back road adventures that includes attractions, hot springs, viewpoints, lighthouses, those types of things. Um, we have our fishing adventure, hunting adventure. Uh, paddling adventures, parks and camping, you'll find um, additional things such as picnic areas, uh, backcountry and canoe campsites, um, rec sites, we'll have um, RV and tent campsites, um, tent only campsites, as well as day use sites. Uh, the trail adventure uh, contains uh, multi-use trails, mountain biking trails, as well as the Trans-Canada Trail Network. We offer motorized uh, adventures for ATVers and snowmobilers, um, wildlife viewing, as well as winter recreation. And then down at the bottom, we have a few extras. Um, depending on which uh, province you're in, we offer private lease lands or crown lands and uh, forest service roads as an overlay. So if you'd like to add certain adventures to the map, you simply toggle the switches to on. And we recommend that you only turn on a few different adventures at a time because loading all of the adventures at once can cause uh, the map performance to slow down in terms of loading. So you can see now I have the adventures showing on my map, I have some of the point of interest as well as the trail networks. If I'd like to remove the trails, simply turn it off, click Save Layers again, you can see now the trails have been removed. All right, thanks very much.